What's up, guys? This is Bill's Cool from Awesome Gameplay, and welcome to episode 21 of Minecraft Portal Survival. So, in this episode, we have removed the Infernal Mobs mod. So, we don't have to worry about any more of this destruction, any more death, no more explosions, no more poison, and yeah, now we just have all these regular guys that are no big threat to me at all. So, actually, might as well just kill these guys while we're here. Uh, let's use this one. Might as well. Because I don't want to get all the boots from it. I'd rather not use a looting sword and get extra bones and things to throw away. So, yeah. Let's see. We got... I'm still getting... I'm still getting enchanted boots. What the heck? <laughs> Whatever. That must have been a really, really lucky drop. So, yeah. Okay. And as you can see there, I've... I've got quite a few Azurite fragments... That is enough to make all of the Azurite blocks. I think it's a few extra because we needed a stack plus 26. Don't I have a stack plus 36? So that's not completely terrible. All right, let's go ahead and split all these up here. And we need to add one to all these nines. Oops. Uh, yeah, that'll work, right? No, that won't work. What am I thinking? One, two, three, four. That'll work. Boom. There we go. And we have... Quite a few extra. Yeah, we have 10 extra. That's what I said. All right. So, let's go ahead and make the next portal. Let's grab our twilight clock so that way we can light it up. Okay. So, I have a few ideas for this episode. So, I'll go ahead and mention them right after I do this. So, yeah, it's going to go like this. Uvite Islands. I hope this is the next one. I'm pretty sure it is. Here, we can do this. I know if you type in... Blade, it shows the right order. So we have Dravite, Azurite, and Uvite. Okay, we were correct. Then Mithril and Augite. So everything else is just like I had planned. So these two go down there. There it is. Let's light this baby up. And let's do a, a 360. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, Uvite Islands. And we're not going to head there quite yet. Alrighty then. So, another thing, I got these moon bulb seeds in the last episode. So they are seeds, which probably means that we have to plant them. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go plant them. I haven't showed it yet, so I'll go ahead and show you guys right now. It is night, so let's go ahead and go to sleep. So that way, that way it becomes day, because, yeah, we don't want to deal with any extra mobs, even though we have all these powerful weapons and armor, so it's not a big deal. Okay, oops, didn't need to do that. Okay, so let's go plant these seeds here. So as you can see here, I have this little garden that I've had for a while. I just planted it just for fun. I planted some carrots, some potatoes, lots of wheat, just for fun. So yeah. Where did that come from? <laughs> wow. That was pretty random. So let's see if we can plant these. Let's just plant them right here. I love my shick axe that also is a hoe. So they do not plant there. Do they plant on dirt? Oh, they just plant on dirt. Okay. So they look like they're sh similar to sugarcane. I wonder if they emit light. Kind of looks like they could. Wait, if I do that, do I get two? No, I do not get the top one. Okay. Well, that's pretty interesting. Go away. I want that to go away. Come on. Alright, <laughs> I was so confused about why that would not go away, but we'll go ahead and place that dirt there, and let's just plant them. Just great, it has to be glass, grass, whatever. Okay, we'll print, plant them. Oh, I can't speak. We will plant them right there, and I want to see if they grow any taller, just for fun. I don't know what they're used for, but yeah. So, that's one thing I wanted to do. Now, I want to take a look at this fam guide and see what else we can, we can use here. So, 1-up gives you full health once before you die. Or gives you health, yeah, one, before dying once, and you have to unlock it each time, but... I don't think it's going to be all that useful since we keep all of our items upon death anyways. It's not too big of a deal. So we do not need that one. This one allows us to glide down for two seconds, which we wouldn't need that one because, I mean, there is another one. We'll, we'll, we'll get to it later. This one allows us to lock, walk on lava. So that would be pretty cool when going to the nether and stuff like that. So yeah, we definitely need to use this one next time we go to the nether. So let me go ahead and buy it right now so I'll, I will have it whenever we need it. Alright, I had a little phone call there, which, as you guys know, I record my audio on my phone, so it interrupted the audio. So, anyways, we were looking at, we looked at this one, and we're trying to look at the fairy now. 
which gives you no fall damage and allows you to glide down. So yeah, that one's way better than that chicken that we saw, because we get to glide down infinitely. And what that means is basically you just fall slowly, very slowly. So yeah, of course it allows no fall damage. Okay, so Iron Golem throws mobs into the air and deals 2 to 5 damage plus fall damage for the mob. So that one's pretty cool. 15 levels, we don't have that right now, we can get that easily. You may think about using that one. Annoys you when diamonds or emeralds are nearby, so it helps you find diamonds and emeralds, but not too useful for us in this mod. Oh, this one is what I want, faster sprinting. Oh, we can use it right off the bat. So, we're going to try that one out. Let's continue looking at the rest, though. And that's all. Oh, no. No, no, that's the one that we have right now. Skeleton attacks mobs, pretty self-explanatory, deals two damage. That one deals one damage, throws snowballs, no goblin. Spider allows you to climb walls while sneaking, that's pretty cool. This attacks mobs with arrows, and you can climb walls, so that one's definitely more worth it than the skeleton and the spider, because it's both of them combined. So, yeah, this one allows you to breathe underwater. So, yeah, that could be useful depending on what you're trying to do. And I think I already bought that one. Yes, I did. I forgot about that. I bought that one a while back. Okay. And that's about it. So, right now, what I want to do is show you guys the awesome sprinting thing, because I have tested it before. Oh, yeah, and as you can see, there are slimes, because I've also uninstalled the Mob Spawn Controls mod because I didn't want it to mess with anything else like I did in the end whenever my game crashed a couple episodes ago. So yeah, anyway, let's go ahead and sprint. Sprint! There it goes. Oh yeah, look at this. This is freaking awesome. Jump! Oh, okay. <laughs> Can't quite make jumps that big, but yeah. That's, that's pretty awesome. I move super fast. So yeah, this would be good to add when we're traveling long distances just to use for a short amount of time. Look at that cow outside. How'd you get there, man? Then when we want to jump high, we can quickly switch back to our arana. I believe that's how it's supposed to be said, because I think it's Spanish. I don't really know. Anyways, what is this hole doing here? I need to go get some wood and repair that freaking mob... Oh, no, not mob spawn controls. Infernal mobs probably did that, so yeah. Where was that at? What? Wait. Wait a minute. Oh, it was up there. <laughs> what was I thinking? Okay. So yeah. Which one should we try to go for next, though? I looked at all of them. I think I want to buy the spider jockey one. That one sounds pretty cool. So yeah, 20 levels. That's the one we're going to buy next whenever we happen to have 20 levels. Alright. So let's see what else I can do here while we are doing nifty little things like this. Okay. So I have these spawners here. These pig spawners. And so I, kind of, I wanted to make a like a pig spawning farm thing to get free food, but... Now that I get all this food from the Twilight Dimensions, like I have this still, I have this that I still have to eat up, I have all this magic meat, so I actually don't know if we really need a pig spawner anymore. A cow spawner would be more worth it to get all the leather, but I mean, unfortunately we cannot get cow spawners, so I guess we're not going to do that. So another thing, this one's completely just for fun. Uh, as you can see, I've had these for a long time and haven't really mentioned them. I have all of these Kraken skins here, and what you make with that is, I don't even know what it's called, is it called Kraken Armor? Yeah. You make Kraken Armor, which is not strong at all, but it allows you to breathe underwater, which is also <laughs> not very useful because we have that familiar that allows us to do that as well. But, I mean, we might as well make it just to have some cool armor, just for fun. So, I don't even know if I have enough. I did it a long time ago, I was just really bored and I was just killing tons of squid because there was a ton of them in the ocean near me. And I was testing out my looting sword. It was whenever I first got the looting sword. And that's when I was doing that. So yeah. We're just going to make it just for fun. I'm not even going to use it probably ever. So yeah. Just making what I can here. I believe it is like this. Yeah, we do not have quite enough to make the leggings. But <laughs> that was solely just for fun. Now let's just throw it in here. <laughs> so yeah. Just wanted to make that. Kraken armor. Alright. So, let's see. Another thing. I'm just looking at all the random things I have here. This healing stone, I do know what it does. It just heals you. So yeah, if I have low health, I would just right click and it will heal me. So yeah. Kind of rare. Rare item. So yeah. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe we could just try killing the watcher again. Let's see if we can let's see if we can do it really really quickly like in this episode. But I need 27 molten shards, which means I need 13 more. So let's head to the Nether and see if we can get 13 molten shards really quickly. 
I don't know if I can. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this, but I'm gonna try. So we need to buy. What do I need to buy? Uh, companion cube. We need to buy this guy. Seven levels. I've I have nine. Oh, I've already bought him before. I don't remember buying all these things, but yeah. Okay. So I don't know exactly how long, how long I've been recording here, but I'll try to do this as fast as possible. And my game's getting a little laggy, which is pretty annoying. Okay. To the Nether we go. <laughs> this is just like a like a spur of the moment thing. I decided I want to just kill the watcher as fast as I can. So yeah. Cow is here. Wow. Here's my missing cows, they're in the nether. Alright. Ooh, let's try to do this quickly, as quickly as we can. Hopefully they should spawn now since I uninstalled the mob spawn controls mod. But it looks like there's still no nether mob spawning. Wow. Come on, man. I just wanted to do this just for fun really quickly. Oh, yeah, they are spawning. Okay. <laughs> I have this awesome bow now to take out these guys, and they're really not going to be very strong compared to the things I've been dealing with. Yeah, 100 health. That is nothing. But he's still going to be very powerful, so I have to be careful. Yeah. Yeah. And use my looting sword. Die. Did you drop any? Yeah, he dropped four. Okay, I only need 13. This is going to be pretty easy. Ooh, I should have left a portal back at spawn. I might have one there, I'm not sure. Okay. Come on. They still don't seem to... F Ooh, that is... F I don't want to pick all that up. It's going to waste a lot of space. That must be from fighting the Watcher previously. <laughs> must have fallen through the floor there. Come on. Nothing. Only one. Whatever, I'm just going to pick all this stuff up so I can run back. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this as quickly as I wanted to. Ah, uh, I did need 13 more. I think I did. I had, yeah. Ooh, I almost fell in there. Hey, there's some of that stuff. But I do not need that anymore because I get tons of it when I kill the watcher. Okay. This is rather annoying because I'm not finding any of these mobs again. There was one, just one little mob. Come on. Why is everything just not spawning when I come here these days? Let's go ahead and get out my other portal gun and just portal ourselves around to other areas. Let's try to get up there. Let's remove all the portals so I can see when they hit. I'm just trying to get to a random area. There we go. Ah, oh, I just put myself right in lava. It's doing no damage to me. It's doing it's doing absolutely no damage. I can walk on lava, I forgot! <laughs> oh my gosh. This is so awesome. Is it ruining my armor at all? Nope. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I forgot about this. Am I completely invulnerable to lava? Let me try it out. This could be very dangerous. I am! This is basically like ultimate fire protection. I did notice that whenever the, I got shot with that arrow, it didn't hurt me. I mean, it didn't catch me on fire. So, yeah, like not only can I walk on lava, but I am invulnerable to fire with this. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. But it looks like I can't like jump up to the next block, which is slightly annoying. Maybe I can like... Where's my pickaxe? Why did I remove that? Maybe I can break it and try to... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I completely forgot that I can do that. Ooh, I missed my high jumps, though. Ooh, yeah. Okay, I'm just going to use my looting sword on you. Three hits, three hits, three hits. Oh, yeah, you don't even catch me on fire. Oh, my gosh. I love this. I love this. Okay. I could have done this a lot faster if these guys weren't spawning so rarely, but, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe that, how awesome that thing is. Like it, I didn't even realize how awesome it was going to be. Yeah, nothing, nothing. Let's go let's take it for a little swim. Ooh, that's really slow. I don't want to go for a swim. All right. Ah, I still wish these guys would spawn more, but they're not. I need five more. Come on, five measly little molten shards. Ooh, up there. Oh yeah, two. Oh yeah, spider die. Oh, these guys aren't even bad because they don't catch me on fire. I love this. And I have 12. One more. You will be my last one. Okay. And I do not know if I have a portal back home. So, not back home, but at the front. So let's see if I do. Where did this take me? Didn't take me anywhere that I know. So I can't even kill myself in the lava. <laughs> so I think, yeah, let me just do a quick little Open to land, allow cheats, start land, so I can do slash kill, because I just want to get home. Alright, so we are back at home. We need to make these things. How do you make them? 
Wait. Oh, I need all of them. <laughs> I was so confused. I was like, I didn't have enough for that. This might be a kind of long episode, but, I mean, whatever. Whatever, guys. Um, I should... I should, like, speed this up a little bit by doing this, so yeah. Um, one there. One there. Oh, I'm doing that wrong. One, one. One, two, three. And one right there, and we're good. Three of those. Oh, was not good. What was I thinking? There we go. We have three extras. Okay, let's grab the things we need. We need to turn some of this stuff into the correct things. Let's just make a few of those. There we go. Oh, that's perfect, actually. We need to put 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, what am I thinking? I don't know why I thought I needed five of those, but <laughs> whatever. I'll take five of them. <laughs> I only need one of those, but at least I'll have them... Where did I put it? I just shift-clicked it somewhere. There, just... At least I'll have them prepared for next time. Ah, I keep getting my clicks mixed up. And I need one of those. And one of those. And... What do I need? What else do I need? What else do I need? I need something else. To go in the middle. What goes in the middle? This! This! Watching eye. Ooh, I was stretching out right there. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do this on the on this episode. So yeah, we'll just quickly fight the Watcher on the next episode, just for fun. So let's go ahead and create the spawning thing here. And we'll go ahead and end off this episode. Alright, there we go. Boom, call the Watcher. So yeah, on the next episode we're going to quickly start off by fighting the Watcher, and then we'll probably go into Uvi on that episode. So yeah, anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.